Hey everybody, it's Andy, aka Max Ryder. I am trying to get my stupid timer to do what I want it to do. There we go. We are still here in the um, in the watchtower that we uh, dealt with the last couple episodes, and we're going to continue dealing with it for at least a little while because I think this place needs uh, a basement that will have crops growing in it because we're kind of in the middle of nowhere, and it would be a good thing. To actually, uh, just in case, come on, jump. Oh, come on, oh, here we go. So, just in case, I would like to be able to, to have some crops. Uh, we are going to extend it out to there. I don't have the cobblestone I really need to make a foundation. So, we'll probably have to stop the video here in a minute to get more, but we'll go ahead and dig it out. We might actually not worry about the foundation today. I might clean it up. Or we might not worry about the foundation right this moment. And what I might do is just clean it up for later. Clean it up later. And then show you the finished product at the end. But I also wanted to talk just a little bit about crushes. Because I keep getting these stupid crushes. And it's doing me no good. It's making me miserable. So I need you all to tell me to stop. So just stop. Stop with the crushes. The crushes are no good. This is going to be a very simple little chamber. This might even be a super short episode. I only have 45, and each of these takes three times three times four is 12. Wait a minute. There's 12, 13, 14, 15 each. So 15 times three is 45. I can probably just put the foundation in. So we're gonna do that. Anyway, I keep getting crushes on these young women. I'm old, as people already know, I believe. And it's doing me no good, just hurts my feelings. Or I do nothing about it, which is probably what I should do. Because, you know, I'm old. I'm too old for these people. I'm too old for anybody, actually. And it's a bummer. And I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I mean, I don't know. I'm a stupid romantic at heart, so I'm just wanting to be in love with somebody and all that dumb stuff that romantics do, but then I end up liking people who, well, yeah. obviously you're not going to have any interest in me, and if they do, I mean they just don't, uh, even people my age I get crushes on, and nope, sorry, not interested, just, no, just thanks, but no thanks, is usually what it comes down to. Which is a bummer. So I'm against crushes. I'm against Don't get them. Don't do it. It's it's a waste. It's a waste of your time. You're not going to be happy. Now what we can do, and what I think I will do though, is we've got this cute little chamber here. We're going to overlight it. Let's um, put these back on. Oh, let's make a place to land on the bottom in case we expand this later. make more torches <laughs> so recently I've gotten a crush on somebody uh, who shall remain nameless but who was somebody I, I didn't know before you uh, she isn't in any of my games or anything like that so it's nothing like that but it's just like the water in the middle it goes up four and out four you know what we're gonna do we're just gonna put one little thing of water here we got coarse plants cooking upstairs let's go ahead and make a day Go find some water. I just met this person. She just seems really nice. She's, I'm way too old for her. I'm, but, I mean, I'm kind of too old for everybody. Whoops. Down we go. Down. You know what I'm thinking? Yeah, we're going to move this. Wait, we need to actually let's get a trap door. Let's put it here so we can put a trap door in so it's not just a gaping hole in the floor. My biggest problem, I guess, with crushes is I don't know how not to get a crush. I tend to crush a lot. I tend to just like people who I guess I have no business liking. And it's just, it's just gotten out of hand. Okay. 
So what about y'all? Do you guys get crushes? If you do, what do you do about it? How do you stop? How do you just stop? Just say stop. Because that's really what I want to do. I just want to stop having these feelings all together. Just turn myself off. Just turn it off. Just just be done. Be done with all feelings. Um, so that goes one, two, three, four. And then it goes north and south four on either way. So that'll fill this. And we put one more there. That should be... That should be good. Oh, there's a pond right down here. That's perfect. What is it? That's a spider. I gotta be careful, though, because I was messing around at night. Got this coarse fruit stuff growing. I think we're gonna put a little farm there. Um, maybe with, um... Ha! Huh. I planted wheat down here at some point. That's cool. Probably when I stick in the course for you to do not want to waste seeds. Anyway, blah, 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 blah. so people say tell this person that you like them, but that's ridiculous, especially if you don't know them very well. Uh, I've told people that I really knew well that I liked them, and it just it ended friendships. So it's not the route that I can take here, especially due to my age, due to the women who I actually spent a lot of time with's age. And like I said, this is nobody that you guys have ever seen on video. This is nobody that uh, I've ever... There we go. That I've even ever mentioned before. So... It's not like I'm like, how do I tell my best buddy that I love them? It's more like, how do I tell this person that I've met who I've just been struck by and I would really like to get to know better... Without just freaking her out and her going, ew, which is most likely what would happen. So, 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 final decision is uh, do nothing. Do nothing. Do absolutely nothing. Just be friends with people and stop trying to actually get people to like you because it's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. Uh, yes, raw potatoes. I got some raw potatoes. Let's see how many we can actually fit down here so we'll have crops growing. In this tiny little hole. Uh, it was 32 to start with minus. So there's 20 potatoes down here. That's not too bad. That's not too bad of a start. I can actually... We can put... Um, we'll put we'll put a chest down here as well. To be kind of the... Um, We'll put a chest down in the basement to hold all the food supplies, or at least what little we can get. We got just enough cobble. There we go. Build a little. Whoa, sheep! You are freaking me out. Why are you looking in the corner, man? That's not. That is so uncool. Oh, for crying out loud! Ah. So that's my latest little mess going on. And now we have potatoes growing in the basement of this place. We have a nice little chest to put them in, put any food in that we get. Yeah. And that's it. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it. The basement's now done. We can get working on a farm out there, possibly, which would be great. A farm would be great. But I'm going to have to do a lot of more, more collecting and do a little research on how this stuff works. So, thanks for watching. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to y'all next time. We have a very short addendum. I uh, started working on another... I started working on another... Um, I decided I needed to get all the potatoes planted. So, I made another room, but uh, I ended up getting kind of fancy with it. I thought, you guys aren't going to want to see all that again. And then I decided, yeah, I probably should show them because this looks cool. Well, okay, it's not like, oh my god. But it's kind of nice. It's cut out of the living stone. And uh, I like how it looks with the flowing waters. We've also got our cistern down here. And that will allow uh, over, probably to get over a stack of potatoes. So that will give some food and sustenance to our little farm that we're going to build down there. And that's it. So thanks for watching, everybody. I will talk to you all next time.